All right. So last night, Kamala Harris is a speech uh, outside White House, and she's entitled to do that. She's the vice president. She can certainly do that. Nothing wrong. The Harris campaign says 75,000 people showed up. I think it was about 50 um, myself, but I didn't count them. And the D.C. authorities will not put out a number. Um, So she said a couple of interesting things I want to run by you. Uh, The first one was same old, same old. Okay, she never deviates. Uh, She said it a million times. Roll it. I will deliver tax cuts to working people and the middle class. I will make sure you have a chance not just to get by, but to get ahead. Because I believe in honoring the dignity of work. I will enact the first ever federal ban on price gouging on groceries. I will fight to make sure that hardworking Americans can actually afford a place to live. I will fight to help first-time home buyers with your down payment, take on the companies that are jacking up rents, and build millions of new homes. All right. No, she's not going to build millions of new homes. That's impossible. She can't do it. It's unconstitutional to ban price gouging. Who's going to be the arbiter of that? It's unconstitutional to give Americans $25,000 in cash to put down on a home payment. I mean, it's all a bunch of blather. It's just never going to happen in in a trillion years unless we throw the Constitution out, which I think the progressives would be very happy to do. So it's the same old stuff, all right? You learn nothing. But then she said something personal that I found interesting. Go. I will always listen to you. Even, even if you don't vote for me, I will always tell you the truth, even if it is difficult to hear. I will work every day to build consensus and reach compromise to get things done. Trump's not done. He would ban abortion nationwide, restrict access to birth control and put IVF treatments at risk, and force states to monitor women's pregnancies. Okay. I will always tell you the truth, and then she tells four lies. And I don't like to use that word lies, but they're lies. There's no other wiggle room. I could, I could say misleading, uh, but I'm always going to tell you the truth, but I'm going to lie now four times. And here's the proof. All right. So she said Trump would ban abortion nationwide. On October 1st, on X, you can see it. Here's what Trump said, quote, everyone knows I would not support a federal abortion ban under any circumstances and would, in fact, veto it. There you go, Kamala. Well, you can say you don't believe him, but you can't say he would ban abortion. That's not true. Second one. All right. She goes into um, the birth control and IVF. This is from February 2nd, another Internet post. Quote, Trump, under my leadership, the Republican Party will always support the creation of strong, thriving, healthy American families. Want to make it easier for mothers and fathers to have babies, not harder. That includes supporting the availability of fertility treatments like IVF in every state in America. Okay, so, you know. And uh, there's just no wiggle room here. That makes me nervous. The, and, I, and I got into this with Hannity. Hannity has a whole litany of things that Kamala Harris said that aren't true. And it's fine. But those two are so blatant. But here's the worst one of all. And this is what brings me to my conclusion that Kamala Harris could not be trusted. She knew that Biden's uh, mental state was diminishing. And to this day, she denies it. Everyone knew. They didn't care because Biden was easier to control in a vegetative state. Harris knew that. Still, nothing wrong with him. Brilliant guy. Can't. I can't. I can't. Hey, Bill O'Reilly here. America is at a breaking point. Record inflation, interest rates, debt. The last thing we need is more reckless government spending and higher taxes, and they could happen. But a Harris presidency 
could bring us into that zone, plus a hit to your retirement savings. So protect your savings with American Hartford Gold. They'll help you secure your retirement by diversifying with physical gold and silver. Start with a simple phone call. They'll guide you through the process, even deliver gold and silver right to your door or place it directly in your IRA or 401k. Don't wait. These safe haven assets can protect you in an economic crisis. Call or text American Hartford Gold today. Tell them O'Reilly sent you to get up to $15,000 of free silver on qualifying orders. Call 866-501-5201. That's 866-501-5201. Or text BILL to 65532. Again, 866-501-5201. Or text BILL to 65532. Thank you for watching the No Spin News. To watch the full episode, anytime on BillOReilly.com, please sign up to become a premium or concierge member. Visit BillOReilly.com to sign up and start watching today.